United Way of Greater St. Joseph is calling volunteers to assist with the United Way Stuff the Bus campaign. Joining us now is Jody Fleury. She's the Director of Community Investment with United Way of Greater St. Joseph. Welcome, Jody. Well, thank you for having me. Absolutely. So this is an event presented by Mosaic Life Care, but it's all to help get school supplies to those in need. Is that right? Yes. So um, United Way Stuff the Bus started in 2009, and this weekend, we will have about 100 volunteers at the South Belt Walmart over the course of two days, Friday and Saturday, collecting school supplies that will be given out through United Way partner agencies and programs. So right now we're calling on the community to help kids start the school year outright by donating school supplies through United Way Stuff the Bus. And so there'll be volunteers there to collect those school supplies, but this call is going out to those of us who go into a Walmart or a Target and buy school supplies, maybe pick up an extra folder, right? And then on our way out, donate it um, yes. to those volunteers that are there. Yes, and by having people just pick up a few extra items when they go into the store, we're able to help out so many kids have the school supplies they need, whether it's a backpack or a couple of boxes of crayons, um, you know, pens, markers, whatever it may be. All of those school supplies help kids with what they need when they go back to school in just a couple of weeks. And you even said a pair of shoes. We could grab a pair of shoes, uh, any size, and donate them. And those can be used for your partner agencies as well. Yes, so um, two of our partner agencies, the Salvation Army has the Back to School Fair, which helps get the school supplies out, and then Community Services has their Souls for Christ program, which provides kids with a new pair of sneakers or athletic shoes um, for the beginning of the school year. And so we're collecting items for both of those agencies to be distributed before school starts later this month. What time will you have volunteers, um, you know, posted at the Walmart South and North Belt? So this year we are only at South Belt Walmart and we will have volunteers there from eight until about seven o'clock at night, 7.30 on Friday. And then on Saturday, we're back from eight until 5.30. There'll be some collection places if you happen to get there after we are gone. And then if people um, aren't able to make it out to South Belt Walmart this weekend, they can always call the United Way office and we can arrange a drop off or a pickup um, to make sure we get those supplies out to kiddos. That's wonderful. And if people are interested in learning more about United Way and your partner agency, and all that you do in the community, what's a good website for them to go to? So our website, stjosephunitedway.org, and they can always call the United Way office. We're happy to visit with them about um, what we do in the community as well as the work of our partner agencies. Thank you so much, Jody. It's so good to visit with you. Yes, thank you. Good to see you, Jody. Okay. We're going to take a break, and we'll be right back. 